On this Millennial Review, we're going to be unboxing and setting up the Pixima TS3122 Canon printer. So let's go ahead and pop it out of the package. We'll check out what comes inside and I'll show you how to set it up. So inside, the first thing you're going to get is your owner's manual, which is going to show us how to get started. You'll next up get a power adapter cord for the printer, and then you're going to get the printer, e the printer ink cartridges. You'll see it's size 243 for the black and 244 for the color ink, and those are going to come inside of this. We'll go ahead pull our printer out of the package. This is going to be a wireless printer that does have air print capabilities. Uh, it also does have a flatbed scanner on the top, so you're going to be able to scan pictures and documents. And all these orange tabs that are on it will go ahead and start to remove. These are actually what's going to allow us to open everything up and be able to start setting up the printer. With all that taken off, our next step is on the back of the printer you'll see there's going to be a power port right there. That's where we're going to take our power cable and go ahead and plug it in. With the power adapter plugged into the wall, I'm then going to plug it right into the back of the printer. And at this point, we should be able to turn the printer on. Now, once it's booted up, our next step is we've got to install the printer ink cartridges. To do that, the first thing you're going to do is find the front of your printer. Go ahead and pull down on the center portion. When you do that, you'll notice that inside of the printer, the print heads will show. You can then take your ink, go ahead and peel the cover off of the ink, give it a good shake. Then you can pull off this little cover and you'll go ahead and slide the ink in and push that straight into place. Then you can do the color version of the ink as well. Same process to give this a good shake. Peel off the cover and then facing forward like that you'll go ahead slide it right into place. And just push in and it'll click right into place. So with the ink installed go ahead and close the cover. Now the printer will have initialized and your next step is going to be getting this to connect up to the network. Now you can go ahead and load up the quick start URL which you'll see which is ij.start.canon and that's going to allow us to get the setup software to be able to set the printer up. So I'm going to go to that website. Now on the driver and download page We'll go ahead and download the full driver software and that's going to download. Now you can open that, go ahead and click OK. And with that, you can now select your region. Go ahead and agree to the terms and conditions. And then now it's going to start checking the printer status and click yes. It's now going to set the printer up by disabling your internet access connecting directly to the printer and then once it's done it'll restore standard internet. Then you'll get a confirmation that the connection was completed. You can hit next. Now it's going to start to install the printer drivers for your TS3000 series. Or now that it's installed it wants to do a print head alignment. So to begin to do that what we first have to do is put paper into the printer here. Put paper into the printer here so you can go ahead and move over the slider, grab some paper, and you can slide that right into the top. And using that, we can snug up the paper to where it's right. And then on the screen here, we're going to click the button to start a print head alignment and you'll hear it's going to go through a process of making sure that that's done properly. So 
So with that, it's going to print out your print head alignment tool. And now it's going to ask you to go ahead and put this onto the scanner bed. When you do that, you're then going to have a green start button. And that's going to scan the alignment. And it's going to allow the printer to learn from the printer head alignment. With the printer head alignment done, you can now keep going through the setup process, hit next, ask it to do a test print page, and you can hit next, and then your setup is complete. And it out prints the test page, which came out looking really nice, all being done wirelessly, and on your screen, you can hit exit from the installation, and it'll take you to a page to give you more information about getting the most out of your printer and of course to register it. But otherwise, you're all set. So thanks for watching this millennial review on how to unbox and set up your Canon Pixima TS3122 printer.